Welcome to Dudier Academy. In this video, I am explaining how to calculate the cerebral perfusion pressure (CPP). So, what is cerebral perfusion pressure? It is the amount of pressure needed to maintain blood flow to brain, or it is the net pressure gradient that drives oxygen delivery to cerebral tissues. And normal cerebral perfusion pressure is 60 to 100 millimeters of mercury. So the formula to calculate the cerebral perfusion pressure is MAP minus ICP. MAP is the mean arterial pressure and ICP is the intracranial pressure. So CPP is regulated by two balanced opposing forces that is MAP and ICP. So it is the difference between MAP and ICP. So what is mean arterial pressure? It is the driving force that pushes blood into the brain and it is calculated from measured systolic and diastolic blood pressure values values that is MAP is equal to SBP plus 2 into DBP by 3 that is systolic blood pressure plus 2 into diastolic blood pressure by 3 ICP or intracranial pressure is the force that keeps blood out or it is the pressure exerted by fluids such as uh, cerebrospinal fluid inside the skull and on the brain tissue. Normal ICP is 5 to 15 millimeters of mercury. So to calculate the CPP, we need to know the patient's BP and intracranial pressure. So if we take the normal BP that is 120 bar 80 millimeters of mercury of a patient and normal ICP that is 5 to 15 millimeters of mercury, then how we can find out the CPP? First we should find out the MAP mean arterial pressure with the equation SBP plus 2 into DBP by 3. So we will get the answer as 120 plus 2 into 80 by 3 is equal to 120 plus 160 by 3 that is equal to 280 by 3 and the answer is 93.3. So the mean arterial pressure is 93.3. Then CPP is equal to MAP minus ICP that is cerebral perfusion pressure is equal to 93.3 minus ICP here we are taking the value as 10 because normally is 5 to 15 so we take uh, the middle value of 10 and we got the answer as 83.3 so we got the cerebral perfusion as 83.3 so normal CPP lies between 60 to 100 millimeters of mercury so here I am giving you a practice question that is a patient's blood pressure is 152 bar 96 and here the ICP is given 20, ICP is 20, then what is the patient's cerebral perfusion pressure? The options given 115 millimeters of mercury, 20 millimeters of mercury, 95 millimeters of mercury and 56 millimeters of mercury. So you have to apply this equation CPP is equal to MAP minus ICP. MAP or mean arterial pressure can be found by the formula SBP plus 2 into DB, DBP by 3 and you can comment the answer in the comment box. So thank you, thank you for watching the video. If you have not subscribed to the channel, please subscribe it and get the notifications.